In this short video, I'm going to show you how to make some Shaskin Knishes from Coney Island 1960s. You're going to make some mashed potatoes and just boil them up till they're nice and soft. And what we're going to do is fry some onions, diced onion, in some Wesson oil. Don't be afraid to use the oil. We're going to add some salt and pepper. We're going to mash it all together. And that oil is going to kind of hold this all together. We went to the supermarket today and we picked up some pizza dough in a package for about $1.50. We've cut them up into little cubes. We're going to roll them out with a little rolling pin. And we're going to add the, the potato in the middle. And we're going to pinch it all around. Uh, and we use a little water around the edges to close it. We're going to flatten it out. And we're going to make a little knot on the end. All right, we're going to throw that into a hot Wesson oil at 350 degrees. We're not going to fry it too long on either side. If you intend to reheat it later on, leave it on the light side. Take it out. And you can refry it later. or let it go a little bit longer until it gets nice and golden as you see over here. There's nothing better than a hot, fresh, beautiful Shaskin type knish. It's going to smell great. The crust is very thin, very crunchy, very crispy. And the mashed potatoes with the onions and the oil and the salt and pepper is just going to make your mouth water just looking at these. You can store them, you can freeze them, reheat them in a toaster oven until they're nice and crispy, but never put them in a microwave. Thank you for watching this small video on how to make a Shatskin type knish from Coney Island, era 1960 to 1970.